Hey y'all, happy Thanksgiving. I'm making a southern red velvet cake today, so let's get it. I got my nieces helping me. So first we start off with a cup and a half of sugar and make sure you sift that twice and remeasure. Then we have two and a half cups of flour. Sift that twice as well and remeasure. In the mixer I have two cups of oil, two eggs, a room temperature buttermilk, one cup. And uh, we also have vanilla abstract, a teaspoon, and yeah. Mix that joint up to as well blend it. Then you add two tablespoons of red food coloring in one bottle. Be careful with that red food coloring, it saves everything. Then you slowly mix in your flour mixture. Once that's all done, you're ready to add it to your pans. Make sure you pat those pans down, get the bubbles out. Then you put it in the oven at 350 for 20 to 30 minutes, depending on your oven. So while we're waiting on those cakes to cool, I did sift one time my um, powdered sugar, add two sticks of butter, uh, two packs of cream cheese. I slice them up like that because it mixed better. You mix that until it's well mixed. Then you slowly add in the powdered sugar that you just sifted until it's creamy like so. Then you get your spatula and make sure you get those edges down to make sure you get everything mixed in. And here's the part of every kid's dream. They come and lick that icing. Oh, it's so good. Now we're ready to ice this cake. And boom, just like that, we're done. I garnished the cake with pecans. Recipe will be in the comments. Bye.